Okay, today's experiment, we are going to make bubble snakes. So we need a whisk, a rubber band, a plastic bottle that's empty, some dish soap, a towel, and a bowl of water. You're also gonna need a pair of sharp scissors. Okay, the first step to this experiment is to cut off the bottom of the bottle. You wanna cut it all the way around, just like this, we're leaving the top part alone, but you can remove the cap. So let's go ahead and do that with your parents. Okay, so once you have the bottom of the bottle cut off, you're going to need your rubber band and your rag. If you don't have a rag, then grab a thick sock to wrap around the bottom. So the rag is gonna go around the bottom and you're gonna attach it with the rubber band. Make sure it covers the whole way around. Okay, so I cut our rag so that it wouldn't be quite so long and I wrapped it the rubber band around twice so the rag would stay on nicely. Now we need to add dish soap to water. So we have about a cup of water in here, guys. Now, can you squirt some dish soap in? It's about half and half. We're each gonna do it, don't worry. Squirt. All right, your turn. Can you squirt? And then can you turn? You try? All right, so we have quite a bit of dish soap. You can measure it out if you want. I just kind of eyeball it. All right, now we are gonna take our whisk. We're gonna stir it up a little bit. That sounds like a water roof, Mom. Yeah. It's making bubbles. It is making bubbles. Now we're gonna see how it makes big bubbles. What we're gonna do is we're going to dip the end of our bottle inside, all right? Hold it there for about five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. And now we're gonna lift it up and Ryan, you're gonna blow in the middle of this, blow. You have to put your mouth on the bottle. Try again. Whoa, look what's happening. We're making snake bubbles. You gotta blow out, not in. So let's wipe it off and then we'll let the next kiddo try. Whoa! These are so fun and so easy.